All right, taking a quick peek at the uh, George Washington University campus. Uh, the flag uh, is still there, uh, but uh, oh, poor George is still defaced. Uh, the, the statue of George Washington here. They've done little to correct any of this on the campus here because it does look, as Lucas Tomlinson was raising a little earlier, that that encampment is, is still in, in effect, maybe not as big an encampment as it was, maybe university officials are hoping it's the end of the school year, they're getting the exams, this wraps up, so don't have to do anything to agitate things. But I, I think if you're looking at that statue George Washington to face, you're thinking, really? You, you, you can't clean that up. Uh, my next guest is probably asking the very same question. Virginia Fox is the Republican uh, North Carolina congressman, uh, heads the House Education and Workforce Committee, the chair of that committee. Uh, congressman, very good to have you. What do you make when you see images like uh, GW and the state it's in right now? Other universities where some of the encampments are coming down, but for a lot of people's taste, not nearly fast enough. What do you make of all of that? First, thanks for having me on today, Neil, and thanks for keeping a focus on this issue. It's disgusting to see what's been happening on these campuses, the defacement of buildings, the destruction of property, property the threats against Jewish students. Um, our focus is on protecting the, all students. We want all students to be able to study, learn, and uh, get their degrees done. You're right, it's getting close to the end of the year. But the, the, the violence that's occurring toward the students as well as toward the buildings is absolutely yeah. disgusting. And to wrap George Washington in that material is it makes you want to throw up. So, Congressman, I mean, you, you've been calling into question some of these schools that get some federal funding and, and questioning whether they should get at least as much. You've gone so far as to say that some of the students who are convicted in these protests and might have had some of their loans forgiven or cut entirely uh, shouldn't. Maybe you can explain. Well, the, the president has been doing a lot of illegal things as it relates to the student loans. The Supreme Court told him he couldn't do what he wanted to do, so he's working around it. But we certainly don't want to support students who participate in illegal, illegal uh, activities on the campus. We have a whole of Congress investigation going on now, and we want to do everything that we can to see the taxpayer dollars are not wasted on these campuses. We'll be looking at every place that they get money from research grants to financial aid. Um, we already are taxing the endowments of 38 of the largest endowments in the country. Uh, we want to look at everything. And I'm very pleased with what Speaker Johnson has done to uh, allow our committee to be the lead committee, but to work with uh, five other committees on all of these issues.